Lawrence aircraft has lots of firsts about it. It was the first mono fighter in the world. It was the first mono fighter to exceed 300 miles an hour. It was the first aircraft to have an inline engine rather than these big radial ones. It's always been an ambition of mine to get involved in a project like this and restore uh, a Battle of Britain aircraft to flying capabilities. It's always a bit nervous getting the first time because you don't know if you're putting too much fuel in or you're not going to spark and you, you know it starts to get a bit... If it goes right, it's fine. It's a normal run. Can you hear me? Hello. Yeah, my name's Peter Johnson. I'm the Chief Engineer for Hawker Restorations. I've flown in today for my own private strip in order to help Peter Kirkpatrick do his first engine run on the Hurricane Fighter. So we have to be very careful we don't exceed any temperature limits or pressure limits. Um, and we want to be sympathetic to the engine and not run it too hard at the moment. So is that everybody clear? Master to ground. So it's going to be a very exciting time for me and uh, I suspect very emotional actually when it first comes to fly this because of course there's no two second seat, you can't get in there with an instructor and if you think of our young men in their 20s probably had less hours than me um, and less experience than me having the indignity of getting into these aircraft and going into battle with them it's just beggar's belief that we had the calibre of individuals around to do that and thank God we did.